Welcome to this new series of medical statistics for ophthalmologists. The goal of this series is to explain statistics using simple words. Being an ophthalmologist, it's easy for me to use simple language, avoiding difficult details. Mainly, I'm going to target essential points that help proper perception of the results of some ophthalmic investigations and also common items in the content of ophthalmic articles that we may come across when reviewing the literature. Statistical judgment is achieved using descriptive statistics or inference statistics. Descriptive statistics summarizes data like the central debt tendency or the dispersion of the data. On the other hand, inference statistics can be achieved using by comparing data or interrelating data. The word inference means the act or the process of driving a logical consequence conclusions based on evidence. So, inference statistics is used to support statements ab about the population that the sample data are thought to represent. So, if we have a population, we take a sample, measure some values of the sample, then we can estimate values of the population. We can have a sample of the Egyptian population. The number of the population of Egypt is 100 million. We can have a sample of 100 persons only. N represents the number. In case of population, it's a capital N. In case of sample, it's a small n. For this sample, we can make some calculations like the mean. This is called X bar and the standard deviation, which is called S. We can use these to estimate the mean of the population, which is called mu, and the standard deviation of the population, which is small sigma. So we use the mean of the sample and the standard deviation of the sample to estimate the unknown mean and standard deviation of the population. Notice that the mean standard deviation, the number in case of sample, are known as statistics, while the mean standard deviation, the number in case of population, this is called parameters. So we use statistics to get parameters. P, we use term parameter. S, we use statistics. Statistical inference can be a point estimation or interval estimation. In case of point estimation, the sample data we calculate a single value, like the mean, which will serve as the best guess for the unknown parameter of the population, the mu of the population. In case of interval estimation, we use the sample data to calculate an interval of possible values or probable values of the unknown population parameter, as in case of confidence interval 95%. Details of all that will be discussed in upcoming videos. One last point before we end. The definition of variable, it is something whose value can vary, like the age, the sex, the blood group. On the other hand, 
data or observations are the value you get when you measure a variable. Hope you'll find the contents of this series useful. I want to thank you for your attention.